Hey YouTube, this is I Master Sasser here. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the intro. If you want to see more from me, check out my channel. I have the link in the annotation and in um, and the, and the description. So yeah, I'm going against GKs right now, which is a little bit unexpected how he was built it. You guys will see later on. So I use charge in a lot to destroy his back row because I'm thinking more ahead. I'm not really worried about Necro Valley right now because I have warning in my hand. So if that is a spy, I have warning to hit it. Um, so yeah. So I end up setting the warning and Lila mills me dandy. I'm like, yay, tokens. And he topped XMST. I'm like, really? Alright. But it happened to not be spy anyways. It was descendant. So he destroys Lila on my token, and with the right move was he should have popped to destroy the last token because without that, I really wouldn't have a play at this point right now. So without him destroying that token, I synchro on the librarian and I search with librarian, um, not librarian, saying and then the card trooper, and I attack the Senate. The reason why I search in the card trooper and not a Raiko or something is because I'm really not worried about Necro Valley at this point. So when I have to attack over a monster, card trooper can get to 1900 easily. And right here, we should be descendant for this visionary. I was like, what the hell is going on? Visionary, it was it was actually pretty challenging. It had 3,100 attack, and that is a lot. Um, so yeah, he beat sticks over my freaking um, librarian. I'm like, oh shit. And right now, it looks a little bit one-sided, but right now, I'm kind of just trying to make sure he has no other plays, and he just deck things, well not deck things, um, he loses hand advantage. Because right now, I have a lot of plays I can do. I can use Riker to destroy Visionary. I can do other things. I can even have Spore in the grave and Synchro or whatever. It doesn't really matter to me. But he ends up um, tributing for um, his guard. Not guard. What the hell is it called? Chief. And he brings back Visionary. So now he has a 22 beater and a 19 beater. And I end up foolishing for Plague Spider. And using Mizuki's effect against Zion Master. Pitch for Zion Master to pitch for Plague Spider. Remove Lone Fire for Spore and Synchro on a Scrap Dragon. Next, I Synchro on a Six and a Revive King. And I believe. Oh, this is where his little idol thing. I thought he was using Visionary Spike. I'm like, that's not a Gravekeeper. What are you doing? <laughs> but that card right there makes it so he takes no battle damage this turn for Gravekeepers. So I'm like, oh shit, whatever. I'll just set Card Trooper and I'll destroy Visionary. But, um, yeah, what I think they should do is make a level 8 star zombie. That'd be so sexy. Because then, oh my god, I'd bring that thing out all day, I don't care. I want to try out a level 8 zombie, that'd be really sexy. Um, like, I don't even know, like, it, it, it could just be a beat stick. It could have, like, 2800 attack, and it could be effect, like, when this card destroys a zombie or something, something happens, I don't even care. But 28 beater zombie would be really sexy. So, yeah, um, he ended up summoning Descendant and pops his chief to destroy my scratcher, and that's his only move, I guess, but whatever. This is game right now. I true nade, and I still a recharge and a burial. I'm like, oh shit, it is game. So, yeah, I end up burning Mizuki and doing my shenanigans with Mizuki and the Zombie Master, pitching in the Zombie Master, pitching in the Plague Spider, and I flip up Brico destroys New Doria, which was really unexpected. I was like, oh shit, I thought it was going to be a spy. But yeah, that's 6,650 6, right there, and that's game. So hope you guys enjoyed. Subscribe, rate, comment to the team. Subscribe, rate, comment to Zombie Master Sauce. If you guys want to see more coverage for zombies, see how I do. So I hope.